Hello, I am Francisco Ruiz, the author of Passlog Privacy App, now in version 1.6. In this video, I'm going to show you how to lock a message using anonymous locking mode and how to unlock it. Anonymous locking mode is what is called a public cryptography mode in which one person locks it with a lock and another person unlocks it with a key. So you use a different item to lock and to unlock. So let's make sure first that we have the lock. We have uh, a database, let's say, for instance, that it was the lock for my good friend, uh, Alice. Now Alice has a master key, which I have not saved, but let me make it real quick. M, no, sorry, let's show what it is. L E 42 apples. Let's make the lock. So I come back here and I use this. This is the lock which I'm going to select. I give it to people and my friend Bob got my lock and put it here. This is where a lock will be placed in order to lock a message for me, Alice, so I can read it. Okay. So now let's have a message here. Um, hello, Alice. And well, we'll lock it. We'll make sure that anonymous mode is selected. And then here is locked for Alice. Now, how can I make sure that only Alice can read it? Because only Alice has the key that will be used to unlock it. The master key was still here, so let's clear it. If I'm not Alice, I'm not going to have that. I might have the lock. Let's see if the lock works. No, the lock doesn't work without the key. Only the key works. Let's put it here. I'll eat 42 apples. And in fact, I don't need to have this at all. Clear it. Let's see if it will work. It works. So Bob sent me a message using my lock. Now, it could be that I want to reply to Bob and I have previously stored his lock, his lock, his lock. Bob sent his lock and I stored it. Let's see, if I start going in my database, Bob, it pops here. And if I hit enter once again, it will be there. What I did in order to store his lock is that I typed the name first, then I pasted the lock, then I hit save. And here's the lock. I can use this lock in order to lock a message for him. Hello, Bob. Now it's locked for Bob to read. I'm not going to be able to read it because I'm Alice. And my key is Alice's key. Let's see if that is the case. It didn't work. I need to be Bob. I need to have Bob's master key, which was Ali 42 Bananas. I happen to know everything about Bob. So what happens if Bob is reading this message? He doesn't need to have this at all. Only the, the key is necessary. There it is. Bob was able to read his, this message. Observe that I could have been Alice, I could have been anybody. So long as I have Bob's log, I can send him a message that he can read. So this makes it anonymous. Bob does not know necessarily who sent him the message. In another video, I will discuss the other two modes, the sign and the PFS modes, which identify the sender. Thank you.